Have you ever pondered on the depth of your relationship with God? What does it look like in the light of the Bible? Welcome as we delve into the richness of the Bible to explore key verses that discuss our relationship with God. These verses provide a blueprint for cultivating a deep, meaningful connection with the Creator. In the book of James, chapter 4, verse 8, it says, Draw near to God, and He will draw near to you. This verse offers us a simple, a truth. The first step towards a good relationship with God is to seek Him actively. It is a mutual relationship. The more you seek Him, the closer He draws to you. Next, we turn to the book of John, chapter 15, verse 4. Abide in me, and I in you. This verse speaks of a relationship of dependence. Just as a branch cannot bear fruit by itself unless it abides in the vine, we cannot thrive unless we abide in God. Our relationship with God should be one of total reliance on Him. Then there is the book of Matthew, chapter 22, verses 37 to 39. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, and with all your soul, and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment, and the second is like it, you shall love your neighbor as yourself. Here the Bible outlines the foundation of our relationship with God, love. Love for God and love for others. Also, the book of Proverbs, chapter 3, verses 5 to 6, encourages us to trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him, and He will make straight your paths. This verse underlines the importance of trust in our relationship with God. We should trust Him completely and acknowledge His sovereignty in our lives. In conclusion, building a good relationship with God, according to the Bible, involves actively seeking Him, living in dependence on Him, loving Him and others, and wholeheartedly trusting in Him. It is a relationship that requires commitment, trust, love, and dependence. Remember, the more you draw near to God, the more He draws near to you. Abide in Him, and He will abide in you. Love Him with all your heart, soul, and mind, and trust Him with all your heart, leaning not on your own understanding. So take time today to reflect on your relationship with God. Are you actively seeking Him? Are you abiding in Him, loving Him and others, and trusting Him with all your heart? If not, it's never too late to start, because a deep, meaningful relationship with God is the most rewarding relationship you can ever have.